Hi friends, I am Dr. Anamika Bhargava. In this chapter of data mining, we will discuss the mining association rules for our database. Association rule mining finds interesting associations or correlationship among a large set of data items. The discovery of interesting association relationship among the huge amount of business transaction record can help in the making of catalog designing, cross marketing, loss leaders analysis and other business decision making process. A typical example of association rule mining is market basket analysis. This is a very popular analysis. This process analyzes customer buying habit. Means which type of product customer buy by finding the association between the different items that customer place in their shopping basket. What are the preferences? What are the schemes? Through which those motivate the customers to purchase those products. For instance, if a customer are buying milk, how likely are they are also buying bread and what kind of bread on the same trip to the supermarket he want to buy. Such information can lead to increase the sales by helping retailer to do selective marketing and plan their shelf space. For instance, placing milk and bread Within the close proximity may further encourage the sale of these items together within the single visit to the store. In the association rule mining, search for interesting relationship among item in a given data set. The market basket analysis helps us to find these kind of association mining rules. Suppose a manager of all electronic branch like to learn more about the buying habit of your customers especially when group or set of item are customers likely to purchase on a given trip to the store to answer the question market basket analysis may be performed on the retail data of customer transaction at your store the result may be used to plan marketing or advertising strategies as well as catalog design also for instance market basket analysis may help the manager to design different store layout according to the location or according to the demand in one strategy there are two strategies basically in one strategy item that are frequently purchased Together can be placed in the close proximity in order to further encourage the sale of such type of items. If customer who want to purchase computer also tend to buy the financial management software at the same time, then placing the hardware display close to the software display may help to increase the sale of both of these items. And the alternative strategy is placing the hardware and software at the opposite ends of store may customer who purchase such item to pick up other item along the way it means when he is coming from one end to the other end in the meanwhile how many number of product he will see can put in the mind and come on the next visit after deciding on an expensive computer a customer may observe the security system for sale while going toward to the software display to the purchase financial management software and may decide to purchase a home security system as well. These patterns can be presented in the form of association rule. We can make the query like this. Example, the information that customer who purchase a computer also tend to buy the financial management software at the same time is represented, represented in the association rule like this. For example, computer is equal to financial management software, support is equal to 2% and confidence is equal to 60%. Support means 
task relevant data of those customer who are interested to purchase the computer and financial management software is 2% into the whole data warehouse and confidence is it will work for 60% rule support and confidence are two major unit of rules they respectively reflect the usefulness and certainty a support of 2% for association rule means 2% of all the transaction under analysis show that computer and financial management software are purchased together and a confidence of 60% means that 60% of customer who purchase a computer also bought the software these are the two basic measurement that we use into the association mining rules the basic concept for making the mining rule we have to make some certain rules and the basic concept behind this rules are let i is equal to there is a set i1 i2 i3 up to im be a set of item let d the task relevant data that is support be a set of database transaction where e transaction t is a set of item and t is a subset or equal to i t can be the whole data set or t can be a part of i each transaction is associated with an identifier that is transaction id or tid let a be a set of item a transaction t is said to contain a if and only if a is a subset or equal to t an association rule is an implication of the form a tends to b where a is a subset of i and b is also a subset of i and a intersection b is phi the rule a tends to be hold in the transaction set d with support s where s is the percentage of transactions in d that contain a union b support a tends to be means probability of finding the data from a union b and confidence is the probability of getting the software those who are purchasing the computer probability of b upon a means the customer who is purchasing the computer will also purchase software rules that satisfied both a minimum support threshold and a minimum confidence threshold are called strong association rules for association rule we have two steps step 1 find all the frequent item by definition each of these item set will occur at least as frequently as a predetermining minimum support count step 2 generate strong association rule from the frequent item set by definition these rules must satisfy the minimum support and minimum confidence association rule mining market basket analysis is just one form of association there are different kind of association rule based on the type of value handled in the rule this rule is based on the values if the rule concern association between the presence or absence of item it means either the item is there or not then it is known as boolean association rule the value will come either in true or false if a rule describes association between quantitative items or attribute then it is a quantitative association rule in these rules quantitative values for item or attribute are partition into intervals if we have a huge amount of data then we can partition these thing into the number of attribute for example age between to 30 to 39 an item income between 42 to 48k k is the currency is equal to buying x high resolution tv it means the person having the age between to 30 to 39 and income between 42 to 48 of any of the currency tends to purchase a high resolution tv 
द क्वान्टिटेटिव एट्रीब्यूट एज एंड इनकम हैव बीन डिस्क्रिटाइज based on the dimension of data involved in the rule how many number of dimension we have used if the item or attribute in an association rule each reference only one dimension then it is a single dimension association rule if a rule reference two or more dimension such as dimension by time of transaction and customer category then it is a multi dimensional association rule for one dimensional association rule by x is equal to computer is equal to by x financial management software is therefore a single dimensional association rule since it refer only a one dimension based on the level of abstraction if the data is arranged in the form of concept hierarchy then the level of abstraction will be the based of association minding rule for example suppose that a set of association rule mind include below if the age is in between 30 to 34 can buy either a laptop computer or a computer computer is a higher conceptual level and the laptop computer is a lower conceptual level it refer to the rule set mind as consist of multi level association rule if instead the rule within a given set do not reference item or attribute at different level of abstraction then the set contain single level association rule then if there is no multiple association then it is a single level association rule based on the nature of association involved in the rule this is the fourth type of association rule association mining can be extended to correlation analysis where the absence of presence of correlated items can be identified in the earlier we are finding the item presence or minus uh, presence or absence here we are finding the presence of correlation analysis present or absent mining single dimension boolean association rule from transactional database the method for mining the simplest form of association rule single dimension single level boolean association rule a priori algo can apply for improved efficiency and scalability for multi dimensional association rule these are four type of association rule we have study there are number of type of association rule we can show so these are mining association rule thank you